My name is Quincy Hill. I'm 18 and I live in North Philly. Before I came to Yes Philly, I was going to Benjamin Franklin High School. I, I wasn't focused at, uh, uh, when I was at uh, Benjamin Franklin. I was just like running around, following people, people that wasn't going to class, people that was leaving school early. I was just doing the things that they did. My biggest obstacle was probably when I was in truancy. Ninth grade, I was, I failed, so I stayed back an extra year, then I just did the same thing again. I stayed back another year, and then I got truancy on me, and then truancy came to the house, and they was trying to paint a picture that wasn't real. They was trying to tell the judge that my house wasn't fit, my mom wasn't a good mom, and it really like hurted me because they was like lying because my house is fit, my mom does take care of me. And like when I seen that, I was like, wow, they supposed to help me get out of this, but it's like they want me to go away. After that, I just started going to school more often. I stopped cutting class. It was hard at first because it was certain classes that I didn't want to go to because I didn't like the teachers, but I had to sit there and pretend that I liked them. And then after that, when I went to court for the final time, the judge gave me an option to come here to Yes Philly or go to placement. And then that's when things really uh, turned around for the good. My first day here, I thought it was going to be boring until I met people that I knew from Ben Franklin. And then that's when, after that, people just started talking to me. And now I feel this. Another reason why I like this school is because the teachers, they got some, some uh, crazy background stories too. Some of the teachers know what it feels like growing up in the hood, going to sleep without a meal at night, like not having a house, being in foster care. When they connect with the students like that on that type of level, I think that's what really like pushes the students and give them like motivation. I got until February of 2016 and then I'm gonna graduate and then that's that's when I'm really gonna feel good. After I graduate from here, I wanna take like a business course so I could learn how to be a business person, then I could work my way up to uh, becoming an entrepreneur. The things that would happen if everything worked out, I could be a black billionaire. I could own my own business, have a wife, three kids, and just stay out of the streets.